for the first step, we're going to head over to search and type in CMD and we're going to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Once we're on it, we're going to type in DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup dash image space forward slash restore health and click on enter. You can run this in the background as you do the other steps in this video. So for the next step, we're going to head over to search and type in file explorer. Click on it. Once we're on it, you want to click on this PC. Then you want to go to the drive where Windows is installed on. So it's probably on your C drive. So I'm going to click on my C drive, then click on Windows, scroll down, and then click on System32. Then we're going to scroll down until we find WinBio plugins right here. Once you're on it, you want to look for Hello Face. But if you don't have it, then you want to click on the three dots right here, and then click on Options, and then you want to click on the View tab. And then you want to make sure that Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drives is ticked, and click on OK. Now you want to check if you have Hello Face, but if you don't, then you should get a folder called Face Driver. You want to click on that folder and then right click on the Hello Face.inf file and click on Install. It should then say that the operation completed successfully. Now, if you still don't see Hello Face, then we're going to click on Windows on the top right here. And we're going to scroll down to the very bottom where we see Win SXS. You want to click on that. Once you're on it, you want to search for Hello Face right here. And then you should get this folder right here, AMD64 Hello Face. Then we want to scroll down to the very bottom and then right click on Hello Face right here. Make sure that it says Type Setup Information. Right click on it and then click on Install. For the next step, we're going to head over to Search and then type in CMD. Then we're going to run it as administrator. Then click on Yes. If that first scan has been done from the start of the video, now we're going to type in SFC space forward slash scan now. Click on Enter. And then you want to run this scan, you can run it as we do the other methods in this video. For the next step, we're going to head over to search and type in services. Click on it. Once we're on it, we're going to click on any service and click on W on our keyboard. Then we're going to scroll down until we find Windows Biometric Service. We're going to double click on it. Make the startup type automatic and then click on start. And make sure that it's running. But if it was already running once we got to this step, you want to click on stop. And then click on start again. Next, we're going to head over to search and type in device manager. Click on it. Once you're on it, you want to see if the biometric services is back. If you don't have it, then click on view at the top and then click on show hidden devices. And then if you still don't have it, then click on action and then click on scan for hardware changes. Once you do that, it should appear. But if it has not appeared, then restart your computer and then it should appear. 